Okay, so I'm going to talk you guys through some of the variations that you'll experience. You start standing, so go ahead and lift your arms up, and we're going to begin this forward fold move, and you'll see, go ahead, forward folding now, trying to keep the legs straight, but trying to get the hands to the ground, and if you can't, it's okay. You want to let the head kind of relax, so looking towards your belly button will help relieve tension that you might be feeling here. And you just do your best, even if it's like the fingertips. Some people like to take a little micro bend out of their knee. And if you're really getting flexible, fingertips and toe tips getting in alignment, but make sure to breathe. Then when you're here, you're gonna hear us say, inhale, lift your head only. And so it's a, it might even feel stressful, but you just wanna do your best and keep a connection to the mat to the best of your ability. You might even bend your knees a little more for that one. And then we're gonna go ahead and go back to that chaturanga position. So you're going to step your feet back and you're going to notice they bend their elbows right away and then they're trying to hover. Do your best. Some people, go ahead, show them the other option where people just belly flop down. Sometimes people are going all the way down. Do your best to try to stay up. Let's come back up and show them what that looks like. Yes. It's going to be harder for sure and assuming you don't have any injuries, do your best. Keep breathing and then you want to flip your feet out and kind of pull your chest forward to create that movement that you just saw there couple of breaths if you need to then with really strong hands I don't know if you can see them gripping but they're really kind of squeezing the mat to keep stability then you're gonna lift with your low belly muscles up into that down dog shape adjusting your feet re-gripping the hands when you need to and then the head makes a nice difference in this position is looking towards the belly button this relieves tension and allows you to build some strength going all the way up the back and then as the breath builds then it's going all the way down even the backs of the legs there Great. And then just bending your knees to come forward. It'll be a similar shape with the feet in between the hands. The exhale folds. And then now the hands will come away from the mat as they stand back up. All right. Samastitihi.